I think it started because my sister uh, models in Argentina. She got me into it and I did a couple of jobs out there. I love tango. At first it's a bit shocking because it's quite sensual, but you just have to let yourself go and let your inhibitions go and it's great. I think it only happens once. Even if you're not a photographer, it's important to document every part of your life. I kind of see myself as like a tourist and the things I see every day are like souvenirs. I use these small things and put them all together to make short films. Every city that I go up to, I love to bring my deck and have a little explore. The one time I didn't bring my deck, I had to buy another one. When I arrived here and went for a skate, I sort of basically discovered where I was in the city and it was a really good way of doing that. You make friends quite easily with everyone. I have a friend called Brittany. She lives in California. Every other day we send each other video diary messages. Hi, Penny, it's Carla. I'm still off there. Guys, I'm going to do video diary entries for you. Probably going to go swimming later. Like, when we go swimming in the middle of the night when we're at your house, I'll take a photo and send it to you in the morning. When all your icons are like head to toe covered in tattoos, you want to get involved, you know. The last tattoo, we uh, decided to mark the occasion by all getting way cool tattooed on ourselves. None of us could afford to go to a tattoo place. We found a bottle of ink, some needles got really drunk and all tattooed way cool on each other. Where I live, there's a lot of art students and they, there tend to be a lot of warehouse parties. And once the party mysteriously got filled up with mud halfway through, and that night I, I lost all of my possessions and I realised I was meant to be going to my aunt's wedding. So I remember sprinting through South East London trying to find some clean clothes to wear to this wedding that I was already really late for. 